President Trump is facing criticism in a state he said won his heart. In transcripts from a phone call with the President of Mexico, President Trump called New Hampshire a, quote, drug-infested den. Mike LaCrosse has reaction tonight from New Hampshire. If Hillary gets in, that's what's going to happen. December 28, 2015, the then Republican presidential candidate Republican Donald Trump drumming up support at a middle school in Dashua, New Hampshire. He loved the town and he said all sorts of nice things. And then you cast that statement about the whole state. That's wrong. Fast forward a year and a half at that same middle school where tonight New Hampshire residents are reacting to this transcript of a January phone call published today by the Washington Post between President Trump and the Mexican president where Trump says, quote, I won New Hampshire because New Hampshire is a drug infested den. We have a high opiate crisis, but so doesn't every other state. We just publicize it more. No, I'm not offended, but there's I'm more offended by the lack of what the politicians in Washington do, don't do and they say they're going to do. Around downtown Nashua, mixed reaction from residents, some offended. I am thinking he's dead wrong. <laughs> Others feeling betrayed. I just feel that he was here winning people over and now it's a different story. We're just not faced at all. It is sad that he said it, but at the same time, uh, everyone's entitled to their opinion. But pretty much all agree drugs are a problem everywhere and need to be addressed by both Democrats and Republicans. It happens in every state. It's not just New Hampshire. In every city and town. You just have to go with the, the flow of things and... You know, it's not everybody. All four Democratic members of the congressional delegation rejected the comments. Meanwhile, the president did not respond to reporters' questions today about his New Hampshire drug den comment. In the studio, Michael Cross, WBZ News.